Now, is this not the baddest WK2 you've ever seen? Jeep Beadlux, 35 inch boggers, and of course the off-road animal Predator Bar. We're gonna run through some features on this bar. What makes it better than the rest? All right, off-road animal here. I've got our, uh, actually my wife's WK2 in the background. She doesn't normally drive on their 35 boggers, but uh, they do look quite good on the car. Look at that. So what we're going to do is talk about the bull bar here and why it's better than the rest and why it's just awesome. Now, first of all, look how far it sticks out. It's nice and tight to the vehicle. That way you're not going to be having too much weight hanging off the front of your vehicle. Now, while we've got the Bushwhacker flares, it's designed to work with the factory standard flares. So let's start with the main functions. All right, this bull bar here takes a light bar inside. Now we have an off-road animal light here, but you can put other ones in there up to 22 inch. This is a 22 inch one. So this one has the optional top hoop as well. We call that the stealth hoop with another light in there. We got our antenna sitting on top of that. You don't have to run that, it's bolt on. You can run, um, you know, just round lights on top or something like that you want. Also winch compatible. As you can see, we've got a worn table winch in here. The number of plate flip is uh, included. And when you need a winch, you obviously just pull that up. Now, as you can see, the clutch lever is right there. You reach through to plug your um, wired remote in, unless you don't have a wireless remote. This is your adaptive cruise control radar. If your vehicle has adaptive cruise control, you just put it here. Otherwise, don't worry about it. This steel bash plate is included. Um, the offered animal recovery points uh, are part of the mounting. If you already have those, great. If not, they do come with a bar. You can see our factory parking sensors relocate in, and we use the factory parking sensor mounts, so they work. High lift jack slot, so you actually can use a high lift jack on it. Now, the factory fog lights do not go back in. Um, we do have fog lights you can put in. I rather, rather run a driving light, so these are our eight inch slim row driving lights. So they look off to the side of the track. These under panels here, this is the non-air suspension version, which gives you a bit more clearance so you can see the tire. Without that one, the air suspension one comes out to about there, so it fills that area a little bit more so you can clear the compressor for the air suspension. That is basically the bull bar here and all the features. This one does suit the 2019, sorry, the 2014 to the 2020 model, 2021. It does require a bumper cut, as you can see. So we have small gaps here that allow it to work with both bull bars. Oh, sorry, both vehicles. That is the Predator bull bar for the WK2 MY14 to MY21. I can't wait for the new WL to come out and see what we're gonna do with that one. Sure does look good on those boggers. Now stay tuned. I uh, hopefully soon can get an install video for you showing how to put it on. Uh, some of you people might be scared to do the bumper cut, which is really not that difficult. We give you measurements to show you how to measure the bumper and to trim it to suit. Um, otherwise, it's just nuts and bolts kind of work. Yeah, thank you.